This is Jones. I'm Dr. Wolf. Can you tell me why you're here today? An ultrasound. An ultrasound. All right. So I'm just going to put some gel on your abdomen. We tend to put on a lot of gel, and that's a little bit helpful. The first thing I'm going to do is just to talk a little bit about the probe. As you can see, when you look at the probe, there's a ridge right here. I'm going to put that when I scan up and down so it's towards your head, and that way you're correctly oriented. The first thing I'm going to do is just to look and make sure that we've got a heartbeat. And if you look right over here, you can see that the baby's heart is beating right here. The next thing I'm going to do, and I've had my probe oriented transverse, and what that means is that I have the uh, ridge on the probe toward your right side. And what that means is, when the ridge on the probe is toward the right side, that your right side is on the left side of my screen. So it's the same thing as if I took your abdomen and put it directly up here. So orienting transverse, that's what it looks like. When I go up and down, that ridge or, or marker is up towards your head. So that when I'm looking up here, the left side of the screen is towards your head, and the right side of the screen is towards your feet. When I look down over the cervix, and I'm going to res this up a little bit, you can see I'm in the midline, and this is about a 19-week pregnancy, and you can see that over the cervix, I don't see a presenting part. Now when I look up a little higher, I see a head, and it's very tempting to say, oh my goodness, this baby must be coming head first. But let's do a little bit more investigation. So again, I have my probe oriented in a sagittal plane to the mother with a marker toward the mother's head. You'll see the head up here, and I'm starting to see the spine right here. This is the cervical spine. I'm going to turn my, mark, uh, my transducer in a little bit of a counterclockwise presentation, and I can start to see the spine elongate. So if you look where my probe is, the probe is in an oblique position, again with the head up here, and when I make my transducer so the spine looks like a spine right here, it is in an oblique position. So the fetus is coming with its head first, the spine coming oblique. So this fetus is kind of partway between a breech presentation and, oblique, uh, and an oblique pre and a transverse presentation. So I would call this breech oblique. 